Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to Suhana Classes. Dear parents, if you are not subscribed to my YouTube channel, then please subscribe it now so that you get my new updates. And here we are with class third science, chapter number one, living things and non-living things. Dear students, in our last class, we have studied about features of living things. That living things can move, they can grow, they can reproduce, they need food, they breathe, they feel and they die. And now, today we are going to study about non-living things. What do you mean by non-living things? Things which do not have life in them are called as non-living thing. For example, doll, pen, book, table. Students, non-living things do not grow. They do not breathe, nor they move, nor they reproduce. For example, doll. Have you seen any time a doll growing? No, it does not grow. It is a non-living thing. A table does not move on its own. So, a table is a non-living thing. So students, after studying non-living things in detail, now we'll just have a glance over difference between living things and non-living things. So here you can see two partitions, one side about living things, another side about non-living things. Living things grow, non-living things do not grow. Living things can breathe, non-living things do not breathe. Living things need food. Non-living things do not eat food. Living things move. Non-living things do not move. Living things feel. Non-living things do not feel. Living things reproduce. Non-living things do not reproduce. So all these are difference between living things and non-living things. Hope so you have understood about living things and non-living things. Now, let's next move for the next part of our lesson that is natural and man-made things. So, first let's see what do you mean by natural things. Things which are created by nature that is they are created by God are called natural things. For example, you can take, you can take an example of clouds, rain, sun, earth etc all these are natural things to give you more example about natural things you can take forest desert sky sea river hills waterfall lake volcano stars all these are natural things all these are created by god Yes or no students? So all these are called as natural things. Students, now let's move to the next that is man-made things. The things which are made by man are called as man-made things. Okay, for example, you can take an uh, example of table, fan, house, pencil, bridge, car. Students, all these things are made by us. They are made by people and so they are called as man-made things. Students, remember one thing. All these man-made things are non-living things. So, students, here we complete the chapter living things and non-living things. Students, hope so you enjoyed the chapter. Study it well. Take care. Bye.